Hey, Howie, I'm liking what you're doing. I'm liking a piece to this puzzle. Got a couple more pieces in free agency that I would like to see you get. But gold star for you on this one. We going to talk about it, yo. Yo, that. A. G. L. E. S. Say fly eagles fly. Fly eagles fly. Fly eagles fly. <laughs>
This is going to help because this guy puts pressure and pressure and pressure on quarterbacks. It's going to help really everybody. It's going to help Fletcher Cox if he's still on the team, which I vote. Y'all know what I vote on that. It's going to help with Josh Sweat because Josh Sweat now, it, it, I want to see how they're going to use him. Are they going to use him on the line? Are they going to use him behind the defensive end? Are you, are you now going to go 3-4 and then have – and then and, and 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 then have your Sam linebacker um being a rushing guy in Hassan Reddick. It's a lot of things that you can do with this defense now that you have a dominant guy. You seen what the what what Dallas was able to do when they got Parsons. A lot of they a lot of they defense switched up. A lot of the things that they did switched up and they was able to be versatile with the things that they did. So, a lot of this is going to be on Jonathan Gannon. You're paying the guy $48 million, right? You need to use him. Every year, his stats has been going up, right? He has been progressing. Do not have him come over here, Mr. Jonathan Gannon, and have him degress. Not use him, put him in the right opportunities. Not rushing him as much as you need to to get pressure to help this defense. Because you got a speed and bullet now. You got a guy that can go after the quarterback. You got that. And he's getting paid to. This should be able to help. And then you got Brandon Grant coming back off of, uh, off of injury, you know, uh, speedy recovery for him. Hope everything is good with him. Um, hope he's ready. You got Josh Sweat, who I think can be dominant, but has not been. Um, Fletcher Cox and Hargrave. I mean, I still would like to make a, a, a defensive end move, if not draft a defensive end in the first round. But this is definitely a good piece. This is a good start to the offseason for Howie Roseman. And I got to get my hats off to him. This is a good starting move. It is. But. I am curious to see how Jonathan Gannon is going to use him. Now, hopefully we have some more conversations, some more free agents come up, but um, we're going to get in. We also uh, probably tomorrow, we're going to get into some more um, prospects that I want to look at. I got another, I got, I got another cornerback probably, or, or, or um, I'll probably go defensive end since we talk about pass rushes tomorrow and let y'all know the next guy that I think the Eagles should take a look at. Let me know if y'all agree with me, man. I love the move, but I am skeptical. I'm skeptical on how Jonathan Gannon is going to use this guy because you better use him like he's been used. You better use him to be productive. Don't have this guy in pass coverage with the, with the rest of the linebackers like how you do. No, you need to send that man. Yes, he's a linebacker, but he is a pass rusher. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Y'all already know, man. Stay Philly. Stay fresh, y'all. Yo, that. Oh, yeah, the link to. You already know, man. The merch, man, will be in the description, y'all. Come on.